Hello everybody, welcome to this new lesson. In this lesson, we know how to create an animated loading page uh, like the, uh, the clock of the following. The code as usual will be linked in the description and if you like this uh, video, give it a thumb up and if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe now and let's go to the code and see what we have. First, I will create here an HTML file. I will say HTML. I will name it loading sex and over here I will create uh, the container which will control the position which would be class center and over here I will create the element that I have it so I will have dev which will contain the uh, box class box and I will duplicate it one two three four five so this is one the box number one it's number two it's number four three three is number four and this would need would be the circle circle which would be in the middle like the following so let's go and create another file which would be a style sheet file i will see here style okay now let's link them together let's see home uh, let's see link link and the href is style shade and the type relation is style shade the type is css now we will go to the coding and create the following i'll see body the body will be margin zero and padding zero two the background will choose a background background color let's say that color or any color you want, I will change it from here. I will say, let's see, it would be this color, a little bit darker. Okay. Now the next would be the center class. I will say center over here. I will say position is absolute. Absolute. From top, I need it to be 50%. From left, to be 50% too. From uh, transparent, we have transform. And we have translate. Uh, let's say it would be 50%, negative 50%, and negative 50% from the y uh, percent. Great. Now we will go to the next element, which would be the box. In the box here, I will create the position. I will say box, and I will say position is absolute absolute from the width I need it to be 11 pixel the, the height would be 130 pixel the I'm sorry this is width width the next element would be the border radius we need the border to be let's see 5 pixel and the background color we would say we need it to be that color then the animation animation animate we call it animate and over here we'll see two seconds linear and infinite okay now i'll go to create the element which is the arrow above this box i'll see box and over i will see hover after that i will create the position the position is Let's see content, first of all, content is null and uh, position would be absolute. From, uh, let's see, from left, we need it to be minus or negative five pixel. And from width, okay, width, it would be 15 pixel. And the height would be 15 pixel too. 15 pixel great now we will need to create a border and if you save and refresh we'll say let's say we have here background color it would be that color let's save it and refresh double click that file and see what we will get it's a, a rectangle okay i mean a square wait uh okay it's over here let's change the color let's see it would be that color okay refresh okay wait 
we need let's change this color uh, we have the next element would be the border from left we need to be let's say 7 pixel so light and white the next element would be the same but not from the left it would be from the top the next element would be transform transform rotate and we need to be 40 45 degree the next would be border radius and the border radius would be 5 pixel save now we have uh, this should be before not uh, hover save now when we refresh it would be rectangle and this is the element that we have it uh, okay then the next element would be the boxes that we have it over the I will see here box one dot box one and let's see box two box three box four then we will add the styles for all of them I will say position is absolute the width width would be 10 pixel for all of them and the height would be 15 pixel for all of them the next would be the background color would be white or what whatever color we want white and opacity would be 0 0.5 means the half safe now we have created the dot we will now change the position of the dot where it would be existing I will see here dot box 1 we will start from the first and the top we need it to be minus 19 pixel the transparent we need to be rotated transform transform will be rotate sorry rotate and we'll add the value which would be 90 degree save uh, let's duplicate this and here it would be the second which would be this top here we will say the top we need it to be 137 okay pixel and it would be rotated to let's refresh so we have the bottom and the top element great but the top is not working it should be negative save okay now the bottom and the top are working the next element but it should be 19 the next element would be box 3 the box 3 has the following from the top it would be 16 16 pixel and the uh, transform there's no transform the left would be 18 pixel 18 pixel the last one would be the box 4 and it would be the same I mean with negative value it would be negative uh, from the left so it would be negative 18 save now refresh okay now the, the clock is let's change the I mean the arrow uh, opacity let's see opacity opacity and change it to 50 I mean the middle half should be 5 okay no it will not work we don't need it save okay the next element is the animation we'll create here the keyframes we have it I'll see keyframes and I will see animate let's see what we have written here let's animate copy paste and over here I will say when it is zero I need something when it is zero percent I need to do something what is it which is transform the rotation transform rotate and zero let's duplicate this element with the value we have it here I will duplicate it uh, I think six times or five six now I will create here 20 it's 20 the next would be when it is uh, 40 
and 60, 80, and 100. 100. Now I will change the value here. I will say from 0. Then the next would be from 72. 72 degree. The second would be 134. The second would be 216. 216 degree. And not 60, but 16. The next would be 200 and I think 80. Uh, we will add 70 to that. So it would be 80 degree. The next would be 200, I mean 360 degree. But this I think would be 288. Save it. Now let's refresh and see what we have. Now it's working as we have designed the previous one. Let's change the background. It should be a little bit cooler. We will change it, for example, let's see that one. Save. We refresh. The background changed. Great. This was uh, the lesson. Thanks for watching and listening. If, this, if you like this video, give it a thumb up. So uh, see you in the next video. Bye.